Hey everybody, so I just got my Cricut Paper Co. 5th anniversary package in the mail and I have not opened it so I wanted to unbox it uh, on camera and kind of give my reactions. So I actually do already know what's inside but I haven't had a chance to play around with it. So kind of wanted to do all that. Um, so I have actually opened this, it comes in this nice flat rate envelope and you think you're getting to the box but oh no look. It's actually another envelope, right? Isn't that cool? So I, I actually, when I first saw this, I was worried I didn't get the cool colored envelope, but rest assured, you do get the envelope as well. I'm guessing the reason it was packed in two is because it's a little bit cheaper to ship it like this. That is my, uh, that is my guess. So here is the actual package. So let's just open it up. It is sealed, so uh, just in case it came undone. And a little tip, I like to resave these um, these mailers because if I ever need to send anything, they, they work really well and you can just retape them. All right, so Erica has been revealing all of the items one by one on her Facebook, which was really awesome. So I know what's inside, but I still wanted to take a look and show you all the goodies. So this is how it comes packaged which is really cool so let's see there's nothing in there and then I'm gonna let's actually use this as a background here um so here's the stickers and all the fun stuff this is the bow clip this is really really cool um this is really shimmery I like the green spoiler I'm a big fan of green so anytime you put green in something you know it's good and this is this is a very large bow or sorry, a very large clip for this so i'm pretty impressed um then here are the stickers and washi so let's take a look at the washi first i don't want to open them all yet but i'm excited because i do know that they're kind of gradient and they're green and they're also pink which I, I will admit, I'm not always the biggest fan of pink, but I do like the green and I think it complements it well. And they're all kind of this like copper color, which is kind of cool. So um, so yeah, that's, that's pretty neat. So I can't wait to open those. And then um, I really like these bags that uh, Cricut Paper Co. uses because you can put stickers easily in them, unlike the, the foldable ones. So I, I'm really a fan of that. Uh, so pre-order is coming up, um, so save the date for this. And little tip I learned early on is that this is like the theme of the box. So if you like the colors and you like the scheme, then you should pre-order the boxes, you know. But And then there's actually two themes this year, which is pretty cool. Okay, so here's the kit. Yay, how exciting. So here are all the sheets. And I haven't figured out yet what... I'm gonna use this for, but I'll figure that out in just a second. I don't know, I'll, I'll do my best to figure it out. But I really like the sheets, those are really cool. And then here are the fairies, so if you can pick your fairy, I like how there's a blue one, I appreciate the diversity of fairies. And then your text, and then doodles, and arrows, and then um, post-it notes, and quarter boxes. And then these are the um, pockets. So this is really cool. Oh, there's two. So that's right, there's this one. And personally, I think this one looks really cool with the green and the gold. I have no idea where I'm gonna use that, but I'm really excited about that pocket. And then, oh, that's right, that's right. Then you got the gold stickers and Gosh, this is, this gold is vibrant. Look at that, that's really shimmery. And the material's really nice. I, it's not, I don't know if it's clear. I don't wanna take off the sticker. I don't think they're clear. I think they're white, but um, they're really, really nice uh, quality. A little bit nicer than, than typical foil stuff. And then this looked really cool. I don't know about you guys, but I find that sticker pockets are really, really, really helpful, especially when I got a ton of stickers and I just want to stick them in there. And then this is just gorgeous. This is just beautiful. 
I might like this a little more than the sticker book, but the sticker book's pretty cool too. I'm, I'm excited to dive into that, but gosh, that's gorgeous. I, I just I just love the themes and the, the whole vibe. So yes, definitely use a sticker pocket probably for miscellaneous stuff that I don't know. And then the stickers do fit in the pockets. So um, they actually fit in, yeah, so they fit in pretty well. And I like how this is translucent. You can actually see through the pocket if you need to. Um, so that's pretty cool. And then, oh geez, then let's get to the sticker book. Now, I will admit, I will admit, I'm not the hugest fan of pink. I like green, not the biggest fan of pink. However, this is not super pink. It's not like a bright pink color. It's kind of, I don't know, mauve? Is that the color I want? I don't know. But, oh my, this feels really nice, too. Let me see here. And it comes with a little thing. It comes with, like, a band. So I've opened it up. And this just seemed really, really nice. This, this leather is very, very nice. Um, and I really liked these sheets. One thing I did really like was that uh, I have... The only time I've ever seen a book like this before where it had the sticker pages and it also had the um, clear plastic pages was Villa Beautiful. And I did really like those sticker books, but the problem was the plastic would stick to the stickers. And this looks like it's a lot more room, which I like. So just to kind of give you some, it's a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there's 10 here so that would be 20 like 20 pages and then I believe there's 10 over here too one two three four five six seven eight nine ten yeah so there's a lot here so I have no idea what to put in those yet but what I wanted to show you was how so this is all the stickers right here and I wanted to see if they could fit into one pocket which I believe they can but let's just double check. Let's just stuff our pocket here. So it's a little bit of a tight fit. You know what? Let's, 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 yeah, it's a, let me, let me go to a different one. Let me see if I can do this one here. I don't want to jam it in there, but there we go. So yeah, so it will fit. So here's six pages. Uh, it will fit six pages. They are pretty stuffed. Um, you still would have room on the back. So, I mean, you could do it. You could do it. I don't know if I'd recommend putting all six pages at once in here, um, but you could if you are feeling ambitious. Just wanted to show you that. Um, so, yeah, and then uh, I like this really little, this clever embossing here. That's very neat, too. So, yeah, this is, um, this is pretty cool. I'm really looking forward to it, uh, and I don't know what I'm going to use for these pockets. I've seen people, like, put little die cuts and stuff. I have so many die cuts, so I feel like maybe I'll put them there. Um, and then I was thinking this would probably be a good place for leftovers, this like, these in-between sheets and things like that. Uh, so I'll have to play around with that and see what I like. But anyway, just wanted to give you an unboxing, um, show you what it looks like, and yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, whole, the whole shebang is, is pretty impressive, and uh, it sold out pretty quickly, so good for, good for Erica. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to use everything, and there you go. There is the, the kit in all its glory, and that sticker book I'm looking forward to playing around with. So, thank you very much for watching.